All right. Finally, 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 a cameo that's in my wheelhouse. There are not many things I know more about than being a Jeff or being in my 50s. <laughs> Unfortunately. Uh, <laughs> Jeff, cool name. We all know that. Jeff, happy birthday. Gosh, you're 50. Uh, I looked some stuff up. Um, that means that you are now considered a quinquagenarian. <laughs> It's <laughs> so dumb. Uh, but you can call yourself that now. Uh, also, it's the uh, apparently it's the golden age. Um, uh, and, and it's an age where you acquire true happiness. So I hope that's true um, for you. I'm not quite there. I'm a little, I'm a little behind you. But uh, boy, I hope when I turn 50... Um, I can just keep that party going. Happy birthday, buddy. My birthday is on the 10th, so two days after yours. Um, so you're a Gemini, which means that you're nuts too. I'm sorry, bud. Sorry, but actually it's hard for the people around you. Hello, Jeff. Someone wants to wish you a very happy birthday. Someone who cares a lot about you. Oh, it's you. So here you are at age 50, having a virtual birthday party with strangers pretending to like you. What the hell, man? <clears throat> happy birthday to Jeff. Happy 50th birthday to Jeff. Happy birthday to Jeff from Murr. And I know you've seen us in Richmond. I'm in Richmond right now. No kidding. Happy birthday to you. Turning 50. Nice. Um... I'm Brian Pacine. Good morning. <laughs> Doing this late night in my uh, nerd cave. Hello, Jeff. Happy birthday. What's happening? Saying what we're here. Um, dude, yeah, that, what a cool idea. Like, I, it's you know the collecting cameos <clears throat> and stuff like that. I mean, it's no less legit than collecting autographs or collecting anything for that matter. I think that's really rather cool. Happy birthday to you, happy birthday to you, happy birthday dear Jeff, happy birthday to you. Hmm, love it, Lewis. Hey Jeff, congratulations on being exactly four years younger than me. I know it's exactly four years because your birthday is June 8th and my birthday is June 8th. You're gonna have to take my word for it, I don't have my driver's license handy. Uh, I'm turning 54, but you've got a, a nice big round number, 50. You made it. Congrats. Here's to the next 50 for both of us. Jeff, Jeff, it's me, Gail. Jeff, Jeff, I'm in a K-hole. Can you hear me? I just uh, smoked a juicy blunt in honor of your birthday, Jeff. Congratulations on everything you've done in your life so far. Why don't you get classy for your birthday and have some rosé with a hot dog dipped into it? That's what I drink now, because I'm classy. All right, so let's see, what else? 50. How we doing with 50? Uh, you know, I didn't mind 50. Oh, by the by, we're, we're pretty close. You're 50. Your birthday is, you didn't say exactly what day your birthday is, did you? Well, when is your birthday? 6, 8. Oh, fuck me, you did say that. Uh, so you're June. Uh, I was in April, so I'm I'm obviously older than you, but I thought our birthdays were a little closer, but you, you were really fucking planning it out there in June. Well, I guess June is right around the fucking corner. Uh, I want to ask you something. Hey, Jeff, who's the bitch now? It's not you, because it's your birthday. Um, it could be you. Um, do you want to be my bitch, Jeff? Um, you can be my bitch. Um, <laughs> I did not expect this conversation to take this turn. And that's what's so great about cameos, is that you never know what's, um, gonna come up. 50 is a great birthday. Entering into your 50s for a man is just about primo. You have 10 years of joy ahead of you. You're at full powers. Mentally, physically, spiritually, you got it all at 50. You really do. 
Yeah, if it's Murr, happy 50th, buddy. Uh, on behalf of the guys and I, Sal, Joe, Q, myself, uh, and all of us in Proctor Jokers, Larry, Crunch, the McBasketball, you know, Captain Fat Belly, Joe Crispy, Tony Gunk, Santiago, Mother Coconuts, all of us in Practical Jokers. I mean, you know all of us. You've seen us on tour twice in DC and in Richmond. I'm in Richmond right now. I'm in my mom's house right here. We've been cleaning everything out. Uh, uh, and uh, it's been awesome. And my whole family lives in Richmond, in Mechanicsville. So I feel like basically we're neighbors. Uh, all right, so listen to me. I don't know if you're having a hard time with 50. Like I said, I didn't mind 50. 52 and 53 kind of fucked me up because now I'm in my 50s. That still sounds weird to me, man. It sounds weird. Like I still catch myself out when I'm out in public or uh, I'm doing a con or something. You know, th these girls dress very revealing nowadays. They're, they're, you know, especially at these cons, they're barely fucking wearing clothes. And like, I can't look at them. Like, I don't, I don't even want to like in passing look at them because I, I, it's creepy old man territory. Now I am in fucking creepy old man territory. <laughs> so I have to keep my ogling to a, ogling, oogling, ogling, I don't know what it is. I got to keep that to a minimum. So otherwise I look like an old creepy fucking dude. <laughs> so that's my advice. That that's, that, that's what I'm going to say to you, Jeff, turning 50. Stop ogling, ogling, oogling, whatever the fuck it is, young ladies. <laughs> I was super lucky to get to uh, put on silver makeup and do a robot mime fight for your amusement all these years later. Uh, I really hope that uh, this 51st year of your life is um, the brightest of timelines. Uh, hope you have a great birthday on... Uh... Was it the on the eighth, and uh, you get to do what you like to do on your birthday and be with the uh, the people you like to be. That's what I always say is the, uh, the most important is just uh, have it be kind of your day, right? Uh, yeah. So it, it's you know it's it's a little it's a little in the last couple of years I've been having this eye-opening thing that <laughs> I'm an old man now and, and it's kind of weird and creepy. <laughs> I don't like it at all. So here I am just ruining your birthday, letting you know that you're 50 now and you're old and women and girls, they, they just look right past you. Like, like you're not even there at this point. That's terrible. <laughs> so now you should be going out and doing things, not staying home and having things come to you. You and your BFF who was a postman who now works for the UPS, ought to be living out the things that Kramer and Newman do instead of just watching them. Load up that UPS truck full of pop bottles and drive into Michigan. Who knows? On the way, you might meet a farmer's daughter. So what I've done is for your 50th birthday, and now I know you're getting cameos for a bunch of people, for yourself, which is freaking awesome, man. I'm not gonna lie, I do that too. I've gotten cameos for myself from uh, some of my favorite people. You know, most don't know Impractical Jokers, but it's still fun to get them. Uh, anyways, so for your birthday, I've done something special. Um, now we still have a little bit of cleaning to do in the house. So I've arranged for an Uber to come get you on your birthday, on, on June 8th, and you're gonna come here to meet me at, 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 at the house, and we're just gonna do like spring cleaning, man. Like, I know it doesn't seem like much of a gift, for, especially for your 50th, but you know, um, that's what I got you. So I don't know, you're shit out of luck. I don't tell you, bro. Uh, I'm still sexually active and I've grown into my body. So I could give uh, an HJ out for your birthday and I promise to mash it. If you'd like to go to a rave with glow sticks, I'm totally down for it. It's just all me talking, Jeff, but it's your birthday. So I hope you do something super cool. And um, hell yeah, happy birthday and may the force be with you. Jeff, listen to me. I hope you have a great birthday. Uh, typically, I, when I'm doing birthday things on Cameo, I will say, have a great birthday and be careful. Take an Uber, take a Lyft, but fuck it, dude. <laughs> You're 50. You're not going anywhere. You're going to crack open a fucking can of beefaronis and... Probably watch Clerks again. <laughs> Don't watch that shit too much. It'll give you brain damage. But, buddy, um, happy 50th birthday. I'm not far behind you, although I would not admit it unless I was in a court of law. 
Have a great birthday, my friend. Hope uh, you liked my little tour around my office. This is like the longest cameo I've ever done. <laughs> I'm just rambling. It's, uh, shit, I didn't know it was that late. It's 2.30. I'm going to bed, my friend. Happy birthday, Jeff. You rule. Jeff, I hope you get everything you want for your birthday. And you don't look a day over 37. So congratulations on your rippling muscular physique. I'm just imagining what you look like, Jeff. And I totally want to party with you. Happy birthday. Peace out, Gail. Have a real birthday. And one with actual people. Or not. Just see the world from the outside. Or jump in the river and get wet. <laughs> but anyways, uh, buddy, uh, happy birthday. Thanks for coming to see us twice now on tour. I hope to see you again when the guys are back with a new show down here in town. Uh, lots of love from the guys and I. Have a great, amazing 50th birthday, my friend. Take care. Bye. Cheers. All the best to you, Jeff. Happy birthday. Happy birthday, man. 50 years old. That's no shit, bro. I mean, 50? Come on. I hope you are going to celebrate... Um, and, uh, and just turn it all the way up to 11. Uh, and, uh, and boy, someday, man, maybe we'll meet uh, and hang out and I can tell you all the cool stories from fanboys. Uh, but in the meantime, I just hope you have a fucking amazing birthday. And I think it's really cool what you're doing. Uh, big believer in, uh, in getting yourself something. Uh, for your birthday, and I'm so happy to be a part of that. That's just huge. Um, genuinely, I love that. I love this. I love that I get to talk to you and uh, and wish you a happy birthday. And it means the world to me that you're a fan. Um, and yeah, bro, fucking happy birthday. 50 years old. Come on. Uh, I will. Uh, I will sign off now. Um, but, uh, but boy, happy birthday, pal. All right. All right. Hey, everybody. Happy 50th. I hope uh, this message finds you well, and I hope that you're surrounded by people that love you and that you love on your birthday and that you get to do something fun. Um, and I have trivia tonight, and I hope I'm going to make it. If I do, I'm going to go in, and I, I promise you this. I will raise a glass to you, Jeff. Happy birthday, brother. Take it easy. And thanks for the love, for real. That matters. It really matters to me. Thank you so much. Bye, bud. You go out there and you have yourself a good birthday. If you're having trouble with 50 and people ask you how old you are, just tell them you're 48.95 plus shipping and handling. That's a good way around it, right? Thank you so much, Jeff, for thinking of me. Uh, it is a weird thing that we shot this movie in 1812 and... Uh, People want me to celebrate their birthdays with them. So it's very cool, and I definitely appreciate it. Thank you for saying Clerks was a great trilogy. Hopefully there's a fourth movie, Pet Cemetery. Come on, we'll leave Dante in the fucking cooler and march him out. Elias will turn back to the Lord because he's seen the dark thing. Get on that online uh, petition and uh, make it happen. Jeff, I got to go. You have a great day. Uh, you have a great birthday. And uh, yeah, you know what? Be careful and be safe. Peace out.